Good day everyone, today I'm gonna share a recipe on the fried prawn food cooked in spicy soya sauce. These are the list of ingredients you are going to need to blend it in the blender. But today, I'm going to use the traditional way using the mortar and pestle. Now we're gonna mash those ingredients together or you can just use a blender instead. So these are the ingredients you are going to need for the sauce. In a mixing bowl, start adding all those ingredients together and mix until the sugar is dissolved. Then we're gonna start preparing and cleaning the fish. Firstly, we're gonna scale the fish using a knife. After that, we're gonna cut the pectoral fins, the dorsal fin, and also the tail. Then we're gonna pull out the gills and also the inner side of the fish. Cut into the flesh by making two lines. This ensures that the fish is fully cooked. We are going to coat the fish with salt and also cornstarch. The cornstarch is to prevent the fish from sticking onto the wok while frying it. Add the fish on a medium high heat. You can cover the wok with a lid so that the oil doesn't splatter to your face. Make sure to turn the fish occasionally. As you can see here, the cornstarch coating on the fish really helped to prevent the fish from sticking to the wok. Then we're gonna double fry the fish so that the fish stays crispy and crunchy. Mmm, yummy! Place the fish on the kitchen towel to soak the excess oil. Now we're gonna stir fry the ingredients that we just mashed or blended just now with a little bit of oil to bring the aroma out. Add in the sauce mixture to cook it for a few minutes. Adding the juices of the lime to make it a little bit sour so that it balances out the taste. If the sauce is getting thick, add in a few tablespoons of water to dilute the sauce. Then we're gonna add two lemongrass that had been smashed and a handful of chili. we're gonna add chicken stock, sugar, and salt to taste. Lastly, turn off the heat and add in slices of onion to give it a fresh taste and crunch to it. Scoop out the sauce and onto the fish. Then serve it to your loved ones and family members. Tada! It's done! Hope you guys do try out the recipe. If you do, please tag me on Instagram at underscore Ernestia underscore. I'll be so happy to see your photo. Thank you for watching and do subscribe for more upcoming videos.